What's going on guys, my name's Theo Atrix and today I'm talking about Slayer Task alternatives that you can kill which count towards your Slayer Task. Sometimes these monsters can be a lot more profitable or they can give faster experience than their regular variant. The key thing about a lot of these alternatives is that you can use the Slayer Helmet while killing them, which means you'll kill the monsters faster than you normally would in a regular case. A general rule before I get into the video, the harder versions of a lot of Slayer monsters can be found in the Catacombs of Kurand. Some notable tasks that you can do there for a bit more money are the Deviant Spectres instead of Aberrant Scepters, Warped Jellies, Mutated Blood Velds, Twisted Banshees, and the Greater Necreel. On Fossil Island, there's a new version of Zygomites called Ancient Zygomites. These guys have double the hit points of regular Zygomites, meaning you'll get double the XP, and they have a lot of valuable drops, with the highest drop being a Magic Seed, which is 180k. Black Demons are a very common Slayer task and can be done decently fast in the Demon Slayer Cave at Zaya, but on a Black Demons task, you can also kill Demonic Gorillas. Demonic Gorillas are very good money, but they are not AFKable like regular Black Demons. To fight Demonic Gorillas, you need to have finished Monkey Madness 2. These Gorillas have a 1 in 300 chance of dropping a Xenite Shard, which is 12.8 mil right now. Another thing that can be killed on a Black Demon task is Skatizo, and if you have some totems stocked up in your bank and you get a Black Demon's task, you can go kill Skatizo with the Slayer Helmet to kill him faster and get XP for your kill. Another task which is very commonly assigned by the lower level Slayer Masters is Hill Giants, and if you haven't gotten your defenders from the Warriors Guild yet and you're assigned a Hill Giants task, you can take advantage of the Black Mask while killing the Cyclopses in the Warriors Guild. This can speed up your kills here, making getting a defender a little bit faster. The next monster is Hellhounds, and you actually must be on a Hellhounds or a Cerberus task in order to be able to damage Cerberus. Being efficient at Cerberus makes you well over over 2 million GP per hour, but being able to damage Cerberus requires 91 Slayer. Another monster that can be killed on a Hellhound Slayer task is Vetion's Skeletal Hellhounds. For each full kill of Vetion, you kill 4 Skeletal Hellhounds, and each one of those will count towards a Hellhound Slayer task. But doing Vetion on a Hellhounds task can make it a lot funner than a regular Hellhounds task, and you have a chance of getting the Ring of the Gods. Next is Trolls, and Trolls can be regularly killed at Berthorp or near raids, but Ice Trolls are most recommended on a Slayer task because they have much better drops and and you can use a cannon on them in a multi-combat area. Next is Greater Demons, and once again, Skatizo actually counts as a Greater Demon as well as a Black Demon. Also, the Zami boss and the Zami minion Kala count as a Greater Demons task, which once again allows you to take advantage of the boosts of the Slayer Helm. All of the wilderness bosses can be killed on the very, very basic version of their Slayer task. Vetion counts as a skeleton, Callisto counts as a bear, Venenatus will count as a spider, and Scorpia is a scorpion. Those are all very low level tasks, but if you're resetting your task count at Turail and you get one of them as a task, you could kill some of these with the benefits of the helmet. On a Black Dragon's task, which usually isn't very many Black Dragons, you can kill the King Black Dragon. He has a chance of dropping a pet and the Draconic Visage. If you don't want to do a Black Dragon's task, then going to Baby Black Dragons is a very good way to finish it really quickly. The Baby Blacks are located in Tavoli Dungeon, and you have to climb up the rocks, which are close to the entrance. You can also kill the Brutal Black Dragons on a Black Dragon's task, and these are arguably a lot quicker than the King Black Dragon, and also have really good drops. Green, red, and blue dragons all have their brutal dragon variants as well. All of these provide more Slayer experience per kill, and they have better drop. On a Lizardman task, you can kill Lizardman Shamans. It's highly recommended to kill these on a task for that chance of getting the Dragon Warhammer. You can also kill the Lizardman in raids on a Lizardman Slayer task, and that will count and give you XP. Anyways guys, I hope you learned something interesting about Slayer tasks today. If you learned something, be sure to leave a like on this video. And if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe to stay up to date with more content. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.